Let it go, let it go. Do you want me to stop singing? Because I can't sing for shit. Yep. Okay, I'm done. Sup, guys? My name is Nothing Just Go. Welcome back to more Sonic Lost World. I nearly said Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword for a second, so I had to pause and think about it. Um, we finished World 3, and now we are going to start Zone 1 of the Frozen Factory right now. Let's go. Okay, again, once again, no cutscene. Excuse me when I, um, when I decide to, uh, have an awkward pause. I just want to make sure there's, like, no cutscene. I don't accidentally talk about it. So, it's been a while since I've recorded, and I've learned a few things. Mainly, you can actually kick some enemies. I think I would have been doing this on purpose, and I don't know why I'm not homing attack on these ones. Whatever. Okay, oh, there we go. I can homing, I can homing attack now. Why can't I homing attack before? Whatever, let's just go forward, and, ugh, God, I hate ice physics so much. I don't even know what I'm doing here. I think I just died? don't even know. I, I, I'm pretty sure I just died, but I had no idea what just happened there. Nope. Game over. Great. Two weeks of not recording, and I come back to a freaking game over. Thanks, past Jared. Do a twirl. Be like such a ballerina. Okay, I guess I shouldn't be um, spin dashing, because that does nothing. Instead, I get bonked by those guys. Is this level going to be give me a problem for me? Because that would suck. I hate ice physics so much. I think I'm ahead now. That's pretty cool. Or I'm not, but let's just ice physics over there. Okay, and we're gonna twirl and twirl. Okay, no, we're gonna twirl. We're gonna go over the spikes. Come on, I want that bumper. Woo! Twirling is fun. Ugh, I hate ice physics so much. Why is this a thing in a running game? Why do we have to deal with ice physics in a friggin' running a game? Do developers think it's fun to ice physics? I don't think it's fun to ice physics. Okay, but oh god, I missed that friggin' bumper. Okay, let's go on here. And we're gonna go down and good job is I can't, the camera's getting all weird here and this is just filler like I'm not even doing anything in these pipes it's just like oh cool it's cool that Sonic's moving around enjoy this freaking cutscene where you're doing nothing it is kind of cool though and I don't mean to pun because we're in ice level but god I hate ice levels so much I think I hate water levels more but in Sonic ice levels are better than water levels and because I was so busy like um racing downwards freaking missed that bumper there Ugh, great. Okay, let's just go into- Oh, great! Another cinematic pipe! Thanks! Oh, man, this is so cool! I love doing nothing in these! It's just cool to watch things and go and do nothing- Or, did I accidentally backtrack? Because I already got that checkpoint. I guess I did. I don't know. Maybe I missed something. And you go another way. Again, I do have to praise Lost World for having, um, a lot of branching paths. Like, uh, I think the best Sonic games are the ones that, like, really capitalize on those paths instead of just like having a straightforward and you can go different ways and this feels like the like the proper 3d sonic game to do that even generations oh cool we're going the right way this time but yeah even generations didn't really it had a few branching paths but since generations was mostly 2d it didn't really feel so, oh great not these bubbles things again oh god i feel like i've this feels like the exact same level we've done before let me try to kick these nope that did not work instead we're gonna fall Come on, let's go forward. I want to make it. And I don't have any rings, so I don't need to freaking lose here. Oh, oh, why are they being sucked in? Ah, works for me. God, I have to be careful here. This is where things are going to get a bit tricky. Let's see if I can make it to this cloud. The rings are useful. And I, I guess because we're falling from cloud nine. Literally. So my problem here is I don't know exactly where I need to go. I'm just bouncing. Or oh, okay. I see where we need to go. We need to not get killed by those spike thingies. Wish I knew the name of these enemies. I could do what I did in Skyward Sword. And just like edit in these names. But I don't really care enough to be honest. And like I've, been, I've already edited the first two episodes. And I didn't think to do that. So I'm not going to do that now. Oh god we got. We didn't get hit by. Okay we need those ten rings. Just to have some backup rings. I don't really care about a one up or anything though. They could be useful. But I'm probably just going to end up getting a game over anyway. But we're going to try to get these. because. Sorry I meant. I'm not, I don't really care about getting a one up. Okay. Deep focus here. 
I don't really care about getting a one up uh, with rings because I don't think that's gonna happen. I'll probably get a hit before, but a one up for these numbers would be fine. And I'm, I did some tricky thing to make sure that I didn't hit the one. Okay, okay, because I think if you hit these in the wrong order, you lose them. Okay, now I just need this one, and then the one up can be ours. But can we land on it? There we go. I don't like these things. I have to be careful. I just want to. The reason why I like to play Sonic games is so I can dash forward and do random shit, not freaking be careful on the on the the, the clouds. Well, maybe because I'm bad. I think if I was good, I'd be able to rush on these clouds. But I'm not good enough to do that. Oh yay! More cinematic traveling. Woo! I'm pretty sure the reason why we have these things is so the level can load. Then, since this game has like a lot of Nintendo aspects, one includes having like a cinematic uh, thing, like. Say in Galaxy, the reason why there's a... Need to focus here. But yeah, this game has very, is very similar to Super Mario Galaxy. And the reason why the launch stars exist in Super Mario Galaxy is so the level can load well. And so you just can see Mario flying around while it's loading. And is there a laser here? Where's that laser wisp? I'm gonna look around. Let's see what's this way. Okay, I guess we went on a branching path because I was looking around and stuff, though. I have a feeling it's gonna warp me back to where I was already. Oh no, a new thing, and cool laser works for me. Okay, gonna use it. Hopefully we can aim it well. Yeah, there we go, and boom, boom, boom. I want you in my room. I guess we just like skipped through that whole like annoying part because I was busy looking for a laser. I'm pretty sure this is the end of the level. And here we go, let's capsule our animals that we're collecting. That was a bit of a forced pun. Doesn't even make much sense. Let's see if there's a cutscene. Whoa! Overcompensate much? Man, how many military factories does a guy need? If you weren't always destroying them, I wouldn't need so many. And done! Duh! Thanks for fixing me! No problem. Sorry you got stuck with a voice chip that looks like it was built by a two-year-old. I think I liked it better when I was trying to destroy you. Yeah, well, feelings mutual, Eggface. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Before we start destroying each other, let's remember why we're working together. Okay, please remind me. Tails, we need Eggman to shut down his machine. And you don't trust me to do it. What? No! I trust you, Tails. It's just that... No, you don't. You trust Eggman more. Do you know how much that bites? I do trust you, Tails, but the whole world's in danger because I did something stupid. Do you know how much that bites? Actually, nothing bites more than having to listen to this dreadful conversation. Eggman, hey, you, you bite! So, I do really enjoy these cutscenes, even though they're kind of goofy and childish. Um, it, they have this sort of charm that you don't really see much in a video game, so it's direction, music, it's very cinematic. Which is one thing that makes me, like, really enjoy it. Most games with stories are usually, like, deep and dark. But this is all goofy, nice, and upbeat. Which is why I kind of like it. So, like, I'm always eager to, like, listen to these cutscenes. Why are you still here? I'm just getting ready. Well, you seem to be taking your time. Well. It is my time to take now, isn't it? But what if I told you that you were the only one I trusted to be fast enough, oh. smart enough, mm -hmm. and pretty enough to beat the blue nuisance? Well, I'd say you got the right girl for the job. Well, that was so easy I almost feel guilty. I do, however, despise the cutscenes with the deadly caricatures, because they're caricatures. Wait, am I a snowball? Huh, I didn't expect that. I guess because I spin dashed by mistake, I actually turned into a snowball. But yeah, the deadly caricatures, I've said this plenty enough, they're pretty one-dimensional basic. And especially that one offends me because her caricature, she's a woman. And get it? Because they're like flat. They get tricked to do things by talking about their beauty and stuff. It's very... It's kind of like sexist in my opinion. They didn't really try too much to make these guys very interesting or like very um, not interesting, not memorable, and borderline defensive at some points. You have the racist old guy, the girl, and the fat guy. It's all like, I don't really have much to say about them. I mean, not, not much good to say about them. 
Uh, but they do remind me a lot of the Monstars from, um... Oh, no, I want to get those balls. Oh, well, too late. Lenny face. Okay, good. I got those balls in there. Oh, God, I'm so mature. I'm laughing at saying I want those balls. Um, one thing I do kind of like about this level, now that I'm looking at it, is it reminds me of those, like, classic casino-type levels in, um, in Sonic games, where you go through a casino and do certain things. Uh, but they, and they kind of blended it in with the ice theme pretty well. This could have been, like, just a ca like a casino theme on its own, but they made it all ice and everything. Like, instead of you being a pinball, you're a snowball, and now I'm a dead snowball. The ten ring is mine! Oh, cool, and I collected it already because I got the checkpoint? Not quite sure, but this guy isn't letting me go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll around it at the speed of sound, or more like the speed of snow, because we're going so freaking snow! It said snow instead of slow. That wasn't even an intentional pun. But yeah, uh, back to the daily caricatures. Um, in terms of the way of design, they remind me a lot of I'm dead again. Every time I want to talk about stuff, I always die. Hate this game. Let's see if I can not die this time. Good. All I have to do is not jump, and then I don't die. Okay, okay. No, 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 no! God, and I died because I jumped. Hate this music too. It's kind of annoying. God damn it! I can't avoid those missiles. New. No! Bitch, that crab died and his missile disappeared or something. I should have gotten that one up uh, earlier. That because I have zero, I have zero freaking um. I have zero lives right now, and I have zero coins, because I'm not collecting them for some reason. Hopefully when we get to the, to the, um, to the, what am I, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get on this thing and see what I can do with that. Hopefully when I get to the checkpoint, I can, uh, ah, get English right now! Hopefully when I get to the checkpoint, I can defrost and get these rings or something, though I have a feeling we're gonna be stuck as the snowball for the rest of the level. Okay, so let's get on here, see what happens. Good, if freaking getting me for okay good and now i can get all these rings all 50 of them that's pretty cool one thing i like about the snowball mechanic is that because we build up these rings over time we get a lot when we uh get a checkpoint like like when usually um usually i got hit by rings so i don't collect this much but because we're forced to avoid hits i can um i can get a lot when we get there oh god don't blow me away chicken but there's something i was talking about before but i completely forgot I guess, uh, all I really have to say is, oh, I remember now. The deadly caricatures remind me a lot of the monsters. The monsters are way cooler than these guys. These guys are just boring, one-dimensional, sort of offensive stereotypes. But in terms of, like, design alone, they're bright, they're colorful. Just like the monsters, they all have, like, their quirky personality, though the monsters were a bit more interesting than these guys. Very similar, in my opinion. And by the monsters, I mean the guys from, uh, Space Jam, which apparently they're making a sequel for. But that's with LeBron James. But that's, I, I don't think that's ever going to come. Because honestly, I love the Looney Tunes and all. But do people still really care about them? I mean, I do because they're my childhood. And I guess they'll just bank on nostalgia. Because no one really cares about the Ghostbusters anymore. But people are probably going to see it because it's banking on nostalgia. And I'll get a new generation into it. So that's maybe what the, 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 the Space Jam um, movie will do. Though, I don't think Ghostbusters will be successful, because it's going to suck, and it's going to get sh um, very, very poor reviews. And if anything, modern Hollywood has showed us is if you get bad reviews, you won't do well. Except for Transformers, because China loves those. That's enough about movies. We are playing games right now, and we are getting killed, and we got knocked off. I'm glad we got all those freaking rings, because now we have a bit more extra lives. But I don't know how to get past these guys. When so oh, I can push them with B. That's, that's useful. Okay, let's push. This guy would be... No. These remind me of the... I want to call them bullies, because they remind me of bullies from Mario 64, where you have to push them off a ledge because they push you off the ledge. Again, very similar comparisons to Mario games, especially Mario Galaxy. Though, Mario Galaxy did not have bullies, but it had death, just like that. I'm really glad the snowball isn't controlled by the gyro controls. That'd be so annoying. Are gyro controls interesting in any video game ever? Just like shooters. Oh, so close. No, game over. I have to do all that shit again. Great. This level's long. Why is it so long? 
And remember when I said I like this level because it has a casino theme? Yeah, I was kind of ditched like midway through the level. What's up with that? Okay, remember kids, don't spin dash. The snowball just causes you to die. And by that I mean me. Maybe if you're good, spin dashing won't kill you. I must kill you, chicken! Ooh, hate you, chicken! Die, chicken! Die, chicken! There we go! Now I don't have to deal with these chickens, though there are there is that last chicken, but I could probably just... Haha! -ha, distracted you! No, I could actually use the spin dash to do something useful! Woo! This is actually fun, though, again, pretty pointless. It just looks cool, but it's not actually, like... It's tricking you to make you have fun, but it's not actually fun. You're just doing nothing. I did not mean to charge off the cliff like that! Damn you, bully! I'm gonna figure out a way to kill those guys without them killing me! There we go. Now can I go forward? Jeez. Jeez? I meant jeez. Come on, let's do this. I honestly don't even remember how I've done this yet. I'm having trouble remembering what I've done in this, in this level already and what I haven't. I remember I did that because... Oh, right, I got here and then I kept dying. And I've, I swear to God, am I gonna get a freaking game over again? Because that'd be annoying. I really need one of those, like, tricks, like in Mario games, where you can get infinite lives. Because that'd be useful. I'm so sick of getting game overs. It's getting on my nerves! I don't want a game over. I don't want a game over! Is there any way to give a restore point or something? Another game over! I have to do that a third time! I'm never gonna beat this. I'm sad. This level sucks. Anyone enjoy being a sn Oh, I play Sonic games so I can become a snowball! Oh man, such interesting gameplay. Let me grind on rails or something, that's fun. Mm. Once again, I am back here. I have eight lives to do this and I freaking failed. I had 12 and I lost four to those freaking bullies in the beginning. I'm not gonna do this, I have to stop jumping. Okay, next time I'm not gonna jump. See if I can do that without jumping. I just get scared. No, so close! I don't wanna get a game over. There we go, I did it, I just played it careful. Oh, thank God, a checkpoint! No, I don't have to deal with this shit anymore, no! Oh, that was clutch there, like I nearly fell off the edge, but then I jumped and made it onto this. Oh, thank God, no, I think it's just the boss fight now. I hope I can get another checkpoint, but I highly doubt it because... Because there's no, no way there's going to be two checkpoints in a row. So now if I lose, like, anywhere here, I'm going to have to do all that stuff again. But can I... Okay, there... Wow, wow, there was a checkpoint. Too bad I can't get all those rings now because of... Um... Because I got the checkpoint, so I won't be able to collect them. Let's see if I can just get to the center anyway. So maybe when I like beat the level, if I beat the level, I'll be able to use these rings um, for. So I'll be able to like use these rings for later. Well, not use them. I can get them, so I can get lives and stuff. Not sure. Also, why was the checkpoint in that planet? It should really be on this planet, I guess, because like you can easily miss the checkpoint and stuff. Uh, can I just get out of this snowball? I would get. No, I'm probably gonna have to do this boss fight. With the snowball. I have a feeling I'm not going to be able to do it on the first try, but I have five attempts. So I should be fine. Wait, where did all my rings go? I guess I lost them. I don't really know. I don't even know what I'm doing here. I guess I'm just destroying all these snowmen? I guess that's what we need to do. Oh, God. I miss when this was a casino theme. Imagine a casino theme, boss. That was... But, oh, I get it. We have to get the snow... We have to get the one with the bomb, because that's where she's in. I think I already got one hit on her, because I saw her have invincibility frames. Did she flee? No. Okay, let's go. Uh, ah, I missed it. I get the feeling if you don't... Okay, there we go. Got her, and that should be it, I think. Or am I just not doing this right? I'm not sure, because usually they take three hits, so maybe each one does more than last. No, I think that... Is that it? No, I'm just hitting... Okay. Maybe I have to jump at the bomb, and then hit her like that. I think that's what I need to do. We're going to race this way, and we're going to jump and hit the... Nope. Okay. Okay, no, I guess not. I'm just going to freaking hit the snowman. Or maybe what I need to do is I need to... Let's see if I, what happens if I let it blow up. I'm just actually... Oh, nothing happens if I let it blow up. Okay, I'm gonna get this snowman right here. Okay, I think I got her like that. Don't really know. I'm just blowing up snowman. Nothing's really happening. I, I'm probably doing something wrong here, and I haven't figured out what we need to do for the boss yet. Or... Nope, that's still something wrong. I don't know what I need to do here. Maybe I need to destroy all... Okay, I think I know what I need to do here. 
We need to destroy a snowman one season and not blow up the bomb because that causes them all to reset. Okay, I think I figured it out because that's why I saw the invincibility frames on her before. Okay, let's hit this one. No! Okay, I could see the trickiness of this boss fight. I'm I can't believe I was going after what I need to avoid. At least I'm not taking damage. That'd be annoying. Okay. <sighs> great, great. Maybe I have to, like, find her before, like, they throw the bomb and then it hit me. Yeah, I think that's how it works. But I keep accidentally charging into the freaking snowman with the boss. And this is just luck based because I can't fix. Maybe there's some sort of, like, trick to figuring out which one she's in, or it's always the last one. Okay, she's running away like a little bitch. I'm gonna find her and get her. I'm assuming... Okay, I hit her once. I guess I'll have to hit her a few more times. Okay, where are you, snowman? And I guess I... this I think this is the third one, because I remember the first one not being so many snowmen, and then there was a lot more in the second one, so I think I actually hit her once. Okay, at least I figured finally figured out what I need to do. God, them, it's gonna be so annoying to watch me be like, No, you idiot! You need to friggin' hit the front one! And not get okay. There we go. Got her, and maybe there's one more. Nope, that's it. Good job. That's that's it. Run away, you little caricature. Do 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 do. -do. Where did all those rings go that I collected? Did they not go anywhere? Ooh, that was cool. Pun entirely intended. are impressive, little hedgehog, but you are destined to fail, as the fat fool has failed before you. I'll get fat from eating your black hearts, you Eggman wannabes! Whoa! Your threats are almost as amusing as your mustache. I must commend you on your invention, though. We get stronger and stronger as we leech the life from your dying world. Yeah, I've noticed. Where are you going to live when your world's dead, guys? Alright, you've been dead too! <laughs> too bad for you! <laughs> I will burn your world, you rebellious scum! I will destroy everything you love and make you watch! No! 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 <laughs> Boss! Your hands! As long as I can still strangle a Zeti, my hands are fine. Oh, Eggman, always the best character in the series. He's so enjoyable to watch. Anyway, that's oh, an actual casino level. Thank you, I've been waiting for that. We're going to do that next episode. Later, and before it's not a real casino level. That would suck.